So once we get done with the exterior framing stage of this house and we put the trusses on, the next thing that we'll actually do is fill all of the insulation into these wall cavities. So we'll fill out this complete stud cavity and this will get nothing. You know, as you can see here, a lot of our, a lot of our plumbing um, drains and supply lines are on the outside of that 10 inch wall. And what we're actually gonna do is once this all gets insulated here, we're gonna put a membrane on the inside of this wall. So uh, kind of a, um, a weather, uh, a vapor barrier that goes on the whole inside part of that two by 10 wall. So that will all get sealed completely. That'll be one fully sealed 10 inch wall space. And then what we'll do is we'll actually add another two and a half inches of furring that will go horizontally across all of the interior portions of the uh, exterior wall here. Um, so you'll have your membrane, you'll have two and a half inches of extra framing here. And then all of our mechanicals, all of our electrical, all of our plumbing supply lines, drains, everything will be in that two and a half inch space. It'll actually be two and a three, two and three quarters because what we'll do is we'll use two by six material that will rip in half and we'll put along as our furring strip. Uh, once we're done with that, we will also insulate that two and three quarter inch space. So. That's an easy thing to do in this case, because what we'll do is we'll do our furring strips 16 inch on center going horizontally. Then we can get R21 insulation. We can peel it in half. That would be your typical six inch wall insulation. We can peel it in half and then we can, up, we can actually use that in all of those two and three quarter inch spaces in our wall so that it's a nice easy way to, to insulate that space. Then it's a, uh, Everything else as usual. You know, we'll have one more vapor barrier, drywall, everything else kind of goes on uh, as normal. Our interior walls will get framed out after that furring is all done then. So it's kind of a, a different uh, order, of order of operations for this house versus a traditionally framed home.